what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Fairy Cruise is at it again. This clown is no stranger to polarizing statements. On Monday, he made another one. He continued with this trend of bug dancing by tweeting out a controversial comment regarding the Black Lives Matter movement. In the tweet, Terry tells his followers that he has friends and family of all races. Then this morphs into a message that makes it seem like he believes Black Lives Matter could become a statement for racial superiority. If you are a child of God, you are my brother and sister. I have family of every race, creed, and ideology. We must ensure Black Lives Matter doesn't morph into Black Lives Better. Although he didn't use the incendiary phrase, all lives matter, his tweet gave off a similar feeling. At its root, Black Lives Matter simply means Black people deserve to live. But somehow, it sparked the notion that if Black Lives Matter, people of a different ethnicity, lives must not matter. How did they pull that one off? I'm wondering like all the time, are they really that dumb? Are they in denial? Is it cognitive dissonance? What is it? How does something so plain and simple be misconstrued to such an extent? Ah, I know what it is. Mostly, it's the people who got a little sense that like to flip, like to flip the, the meanings and the phrases and the symbols to just kind of like throw a monkey wrench in the movement. But I do believe that the majority of people who say all lives matter have no clue what the hell they're saying. They, can't, they don't even know that they're being tricked. I think they really do come to these conclusions that if Black lives matter, then other lives must not matter to say something like that. They're not that smart. So, this dude, Terry Crews, I've said it before, he is just a broken buck. Nothing more. Who was the woman that sang that song? Um, how did we get here? Terry, how did you get here? You were not supposed to be here. It seemed like it just came out of nowhere, but I realized what he did. He pulled a Stacy Dash. Use the black community till you can get what you want. You can cross over, get your white fans, and then throw the black community under the bus. Like, don't give a damn what they think. Just chuck a job, chuck a job, chuck a job. Chuck a chuck a chuck a chuck a Massa, massa, massa. Come on, hang me, massa. What do you want to do to me? You want to bend me over, massa? I'm yours. That's why you let that dude feel on him. You can't tell me a man with all those muscles who let some little old scrungy Hollywood executive grab him by his private parts in front of this woman. And do, he does nothing about it. Nothing. But go write a complaint and file a lawsuit later. Come on, fam. The only reason why he probably said anything is because his wife 
started looking at him sus. And while he's making all of these statements, these incendiary statements about black folks that offend black folks, where is his wife in all of this? She's silent and you know, like I know, silence is consent. Say what you will about Terry Crews. But one thing about it, man, this guy loves his buttermilk biscuits, piping hot, dripping with Aunt your mama sir, and butter, and jelly. This dude is one of the worst. Fairy Cruz, your mama should be embarrassed and your daddy should have pulled out. No more talk. What the ladies talking about?